Okay, so what's happening? Today is the first day of my diet challenge, my fitness challenge, and I'm off to see Darren Donaldson. Uh, Darren is a uh, personal trainer to the stars. Uh, he's uh, Susanna Constantine's personal trainer, as in Trini and Susanna. And uh, he's a friend of a friend. And what happened was, when he found out that I was going to be doing this weight loss fitness challenge for charity, uh, he had to get involved. He's Australian. You know how Australians love a charitable challenge. And uh, I'm really excited. Hopefully he's going to really help me make this thing stick and help me with a lifestyle change. The only problem is I was supposed to meet him five minutes ago. I'm running late and I've got a bit of a cough and a cold. So uh, I'm not in great shape. Uh, but perhaps all of that is me just making excuses because what Darren's going to be doing is measuring me to see just how fat I actually am. So uh, I think he's also going to be testing my fitness to see just how unfit I actually am. So uh, I'm fat, I'm lazy, and I'm late, so I'm also unreliable. Uh, not a great start. Hopefully, next time you see me, I'll still be alive. All right, Darren's just up here. Okay, come on, let's go meet him. Okay, right. Here we are. Hi, Darren. Hi, okay, sorry, I'm shoving a camera in your face now as well. Right. I've been explaining that uh, being Australian, you love a charity challenge and indeed a hopeless cause. Uh, if you can get me fit, then maybe England can actually beat Australia rugby, sorry. Back off. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's cool. Right, so let's go and do some training. That's and, right. you know, officially on camera, thank you very much no for worries, this. Worries. Fantastic. No well, I might not be thanking you afterwards if I die. I've got a bit of a cough and a cold. Everyone's got one, don't worry about it. Yeah? Yeah, yeah? nice. As long as you don't give me your germs, it'll be fine. Oh, no, I wasn't, we weren't going to kiss, were we? It was, just, <laughs> it was just exercising. Good. All right, no let's worries. do it. It's possible. Hello. I've had my fitness assessment. Here's the man, Darren. Say hi. So, is it looking good? I mean, how bad's the news? The uh, news ain't that bad. Your flexibility's pretty good. Um, your fitness is pretty good too. Uh, you just obviously need to work on. Well, we're going to start on Saturday with the outdoor session, so that's going to be pretty much it. That's going to really set your pace and test your actual limits. Sure. So that was just trial and error to see what you're capable of doing. Right. You'll be right. You'll be fine for Saturday. Right. Okay. And so then next time when we meet, we're going to talk. Okay, what, what's, what is the bad news fat-wise? How much fat have I actually got? Exactly what I need right. to eat to get a handle on that? I'll have that information for you. For Fantastic. Saturday. Okay, great. All, All right, right, great. So thanks very much. Um, that was Darren. That's fantastic. Uh, I'm not going to let on to him now that uh, I feel like a sack of potatoes. Okay, so that was my first session with Darren. Nice guy. Very encouraging, actually. And the, the good news, as it turns out, is, well, it's good news, bad news. Uh, the bad news, we already know, I'm fat. Um, way too fat, in fact, for my size. I'm probably, I don't know, 15, 20 kilos overweight. But we knew that already, because that's what I set myself as a target to lose at the beginning of the challenge. The good news, which actually I found really encouraging, is uh, I'm much fitter than I thought I was. Um, I thought I was really badly out of shape, but actually, according to Darren, I'm on the good to average side. So that's not bad. I seem to be able to run okay. Uh, I can lift pretty average weight. Uh, I'm not too badly out of breath. And after a nice shower, uh, I'm feeling fine now. So uh, actually, this is very encouraging. I'm feeling quite inspired. I guess um, the important thing to take away is that, you know, the anticipation of being a big fat git and exercising being awful actually probably stops you from getting started you know now I can't wait to go I'm gonna hook up with Darren on Saturday for some jogging see me then and uh, of course there's still a chance I'll drop dead with a heart attack at any minute but somehow I'm feeling more positive peace